Alright guys, so it's uh, Sunday today, um, just chilling, having a beer, um, this is my uh, one of my smash beers I've done, um, Thursday night Tom done his cast, it was a great crack, really was, um, he, he got his uh, equipment all set up well, and then on uh, Friday night, Harry did his. That was a good laugh. He finished around, I don't know, I think it was about quarter past twelve. <coughs> then Zippy um, decided to take over. So Zippy was playing a few tunes and talking about beer and that. And uh, on Facebook chat, Jonah said, oh, I'm trying to set up my um, equipment. Can you have a look? So I went over, the, over to his uh, channel. And Harry was there uh, talking him through how to set it up. So eventually Jonah got his mic settings right and that after <laughs> after a bit of test and he got it right eventually. Um, uh, he started playing songs. So I was zipping between both channels, watching both of them at, uh, at different songs on different channels. Um, and then they decided to um, try and invite each other on the cast. And they did, so we had them both up on, on, on my computer. I had two screens open, one with uh, Zippy, one with Jonah. And they were doing a dual cast, and it was absolutely fantastic. So I think there'd be more, to, uh, more of that to come in the future as well. Anyway, there's my uh, smash bit. It looks darker on camera, but it is nice. But I did ball the shite out of this one to, to caramelise it. Hmm. nice that is nice right when I did the midnight brew um, I, I bought these um, you've probably seen them in a video I bought these to put my pellet hops in but at the same time of buying those ones I bought one like this now I used this one on the midnight brew and I put pellets in this one but the holes um, are too big. So when, when the pellets just go to mush, it was just seeping out anyway. So that type didn't work. They're great, they're a little bit small. Um, if it's small additions of uh, pellet hops, they're okay. But I'm, look, I'm looking online for big bigger ones than these. But I was just sitting here, having a beer, looking at that. And I thought, hold on, wait a minute, I'll... Uh, try and make a bazooka homemade one so in my shed because I keep a bearded dragon um, when I used to keep his live food I bought some of this um, uh, stainless steel fine mesh uh, to make a, a lid on the um, insects cage that I used to keep them in locusts and things so they couldn't escape so I had some of this left over so what I've got, that's the lid that goes on that side. So I've taken my ball valve apart. Now that's the nut that's inside. So if I drill a hole in that and put that on like that and tighten it all together, I should be able to connect that inside. Um, so what I've done, I've cut a little small disc of this mesh to go in this side, so that fits in like that. And in here, I've done a, a thin tube of the fine mesh and I've slotted it in. I cut it perfectly to the right size and it just fits in there nicely. I don't think you'll see that, but it fits in there nicely. So now, with my step drill that I bought. That one. I'm going to drill a hole in that lid to that size. So that will then fit on there. Connect all my ball valve up. Then I've got my mash, uh, 
my, my fine mesh in that one, that will just connect on. And there you go, I've got a homemade bazooka and I think it will work well. So, first of all, I have a little drink. You might have noticed this. I've got my uh, Scusi 67 Brewing t-shirt on post on Saturday. Um, I was ordering some more business cards and it said why not have a t-shirt for 4 99 just upload your logo so I thought there you go I uploaded my SKU C67 Brewing logo on and arrived yesterday so that's happy days so I'm gonna finish this bit okay, get on guys, with this um, back I'm to on my shed a little bit and uh, cheers guys there's the hole in the little lid so there's the other end of my uh, connection, if I've done this right, which I have, it fits perfect. So, this bit, I'm just going to screw all the way down, I'll get some more uh, plumber's tape on that when I'm threading it up. That fits pretty good. And I've got my uh, rubber washer, so I'm going to put my um, ball valve back together and I'll give you a little look after I've done. Cheers. Right, guys, uh, I've got the ball valve back, back on. And there we go, <laughs> inside I've got my new homemade bazooka type thing. Um, if I can just balance this here and then that just turns and pulls out and then I can clean it um, so I think um, it's hard to do it one handed but there we go that's it back in so there we go guys one homemade bazooka Hi guys, um, Sunday today, um, I'm doing a lager for the summer, for the missus, I'll probably have a few of them as well. Uh, you can hear the music in the background, that's uh, Harry, he's uh, doing a live cast brew day, um, he did one yesterday as well, it was fantastic, uh, I think today he's doing a, an IPA, um, I'm just waiting for my uh, Master complete, we've got another 13 minutes. Um, so, just distance and sound tunes. And brewing along with Harry. <laughs> nice one. Alright, guys, I'm, uh, this is my second runnings of uh, batch spuds in this uh, lager. So, it's all going well. Still uh, listening to Harry. He's uh, looks like he's just taking a reading outside with his tractometer. <laughs> and he's, um, he's brewing an IPA. Looks like he's had a good fun day, same as me. So um, anyway, just waiting for this to do. Then the ball goes on. Time for a beer, I think. Cheers guys. Right guys, that's my first edition gone in. Terry's still uh, casting. Just send him a little message, told him to give me a wave. He's had a good brew day, same as me. Had a few beers. He's waving. <laughs> Cheers, Hello, mate. Martin. <laughs> there we go. Nice one, Harry. Well, there you go. So we're brewing at the same time. I'm enjoying these tunes. It's been a good day. Another few good beers down my neck. 
There you go. That's what weekends are all about. Right guys, that's me starting to uh, chill my walk down. And uh, I'm listening to Harry playing the guitar. Yeah, go Harry, man. <laughs> what a great afternoon. Well, it's all looking good here, guys. Drinking a... Uh, a porter. Enjoy my Sunday afternoon. Then we'd have to sleep with Steve. We'd all be gay. Fucking brilliant. How fucking bad was that? Alright, guys, that's me. Um Walk chill down there, just transferring it into the uh, fermentation bucket. Um, let's hope the homemade um, zuka is going to work. Seems okay so far. It's coming through. Looks lovely and clear. Harry's still playing the guitar. Had a great afternoon. But there you go. There's. Um, that's draining away like nicely now. Yep, well, I'm happy with that. Seems to be working okay. But the proof's in the uh, pudding, as they say, towards the end. <laughs> if I could offer you only one tip for the future, sunscreen would be it. The long term benefits of sunscreen. Nice one, Harry. It's been a great afternoon, mate. Where is the rest of my advice? Well, there, guys, that's filling up nicely. Bazooka, homemade bazooka is not clogging up. So, I'm pretty happy with that. Enjoy the 